Okay, good evening, welcome to Talk Community tonight. We have an AMA with Nympha World. Um, here to speak about that is uh, Nympha Exu and Nympha Chi. Um, so yeah, if we could just maybe start with a bit of your background in crypto, guys, that'd be great. Okay, um, it's good to be here. Thank you. Um, my name is Chi, and uh, I'm the marketing director for uh, Nympha World. And if you look at uh, the uh, the list you will see Nifa Shi. Uh, he is uh, our CEO. He will be uh, he will be uh, sharing some information later on with us. And I'll just give you a little bit of background of us. <clears throat> okay, we. I should turn on my camera. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, sorry, Eddie, do you want to speak? Oh, okay. So, uh, hi everyone. Um, uh, I'm Ding. I'm uh, from the uh, from the Barkindo Studio. So, uh, um, tonight I'm very exciting to uh, share our project with all of you. Um. Uh, since I have the code over there, right. so, Sorry, <laughs> so I want exactly. yeah. So I would invite the the Eddie to share our project with all of you. Oh, uh, so okay, so Eddie. Move okay. Uh, okay. Thank you. Right. Uh, hi guys. Um, we are Nifl World. We are a, a Taiwanese <laughs> company uh, developing this uh, game by uh, game, and uh, we we actually have a. a actual company here in Taiwan, Kaohsiung. If you are in Kaohsiung, you can visit us. Um, we are a professional entertainment interactive game developer company. Uh, we develop uh, uh, numbers, uh, a lot of different uh, VR and AR applications in entertainment, industrial, education, uh, and uh, for, for, for government as well. So we, uh, I would say, we are very, we have rich experience in game development and um, AR, VR, or um, like uh, uh, the uh, game development for the last four years. So, uh, so it's uh, it's our pleasure and and our goal is to is actually to uh, develop uh, like uh, a different game five uh, experience. So. Uh, if you look at our website, you will probably think uh, it looks just it looks a, a bit like uh, XC Infinity, but it actually has a different uh, uh, content in it. We have we actually develop uh, different uh, gaming strategies. You have to use uh, like uh, the the game you used to play, like Dota or uh, uh, League of Legends. You can uh, you have to uh, play it with uh, three levels um, and use strategy to play it. So and we also uh, put in uh, like staking uh, system and um, idle system. Uh, we have breeding system as well. And um, uh, because we are a, a AR and VR developed uh, developed company, so we are intended to uh, actually uh, uh, take that into like some some kind of a, a, the actual uh, of online vis uh, online to offline or uh, the uh, development in the future. So uh, it, it, we have a lot, a lot of ideas and in and this project, and we do a lot of uh, full game testing uh, beforehand. So uh, we are very exciting to to show you guys this game. Uh, so that's just a little bit of background of us. Cool. Yeah. The the Nympha world is going to be like a P2E uh, League of Legend uh, mixed with Axie Infinity, a uh, blockchain game, turn-based. Uh, how's that going to work for investors? And is it in-house or is it outsourced, uh, the making of the game? Uh, it's actually in-source in because we, uh, like I said before, we have, uh, we uh, this company is called the Barking, uh, this company is called the Barking Dock uh, Entertainment. You can actually look it up. Uh, uh, to uh, from the website and and uh, we have like thirty developers uh, 
developing this game right now. So it's an, it's totally, fully in-house development. Cool. Yeah, you're going to have staking in the game where if you own three of the uh, Nympho NFTs, you'll be able to um, stake. How will that work for investors? Um, sorry, can you rephrase that question again? Yeah. Yeah, you're going to have a staking in game where you have three of the Nympho NFTs um, yeah. and then you actually stake in the game. How, how's that going to work for investors? Okay. Um, you uh, to to start uh, staking, you you need to have like at least uh, five or uh, three or five uh, nippers to start. So uh, you need uh, each nipper is is an NFT. So uh, you can purchase NFT. We we are actually doing a, a wireless pre-sale right now. Uh, so you uh, you purchase the NFTs and then uh, you you put it in in, in the game. So uh, we, along with the token, we are releasing in the February uh, early February this year. Uh, so it will generate a little bit of rewards, and then uh, so that sort of uh, complete the, the staking uh, system for the investors. Awesome! And then you're going to have like daily quests and a maze adventure, PvP, and exactly. play to earn in the game as well. How, yeah. How will that work? Yeah. So we have a uh, different variety of different uh, uh, gameplays for uh, for players to 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 enjoy. Yeah. You're going to have a tournaments and a guild system in the uh, and in fair world, yeah. Yeah, uh, the the guild system will be released on um, uh, uh, Q3, so roughly about uh, June or July. Uh, that's uh, that's for uh, the, the 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 tournament. So uh, at the beginning, just uh, uh, during the quarter quarter two, we uh, you can enjoy the PvP P, PVE system. So it's basically just. Uh, this is uh, you, you visit the, um, the the environment or the computers, and then um, in Q3, then you can actually uh, play with uh, you can play against with uh, different uh, uh, players around the world. So that's sort of like a, a tournament, and and the guild system is like uh, you can team up and uh, and 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 beat uh, and uh, like defeat the, the the mega boss or uh, uh, finish some quests. Uh, to earn uh, more tokens, and the NFTs tie into the uh, the gaming world as well. You've you've had a, a first, second, and a third wave of NFTs. How many are going to be minted in total, and uh, what are you going to use the profits for, for uh, from the uh, NFTs? Yeah, uh, the total NFT uh, we um, we uh, the first we because we just finished our uh, our first uh, pre sale, so. It's roughly about uh, three thousand, and uh, our goal is to is seven thousand. Um, but uh, you, we can, because uh, like I said before, we have the the uh, the breeding system, so uh, uh, we can uh, uh, breed it up to I think it's about ten thousand uh, entities. So uh, so that's that's the number. Uh, if if I'm not correct, uh, Dean, you can uh, you can correct me if you if you have any uh, if, uh, yeah, you 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 want to add anything. Yeah. Do um, you want to? Um, oh, good. Oh, good. <laughs> yeah. Did anyone yeah want to add to that from the team or? Sorry, what was that? Did any anyone want to add to that uh, from the team? Well, yeah, that's fine. Um, yeah. And your, your your public sale is going to be announced. Uh, what's the sort of timeline uh, for uh, launch and the public sale? When is the public sale? You say, uh, yeah, uh, Dean, do you want to answer that? When is the public sale? The NFT or ideal for the token? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You mean you mean, you mean the token or or NFTs? Both, yeah. Both. Yeah. So, uh, for the uh for the NFT, uh, the second web and the the mm -hmm. second web and the NFT presale uh will be launched, uh, on the fourteen to sixteen June, right? Yeah. And um, 
maybe we won't open the we we won't open for the public sale. Uh, we 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 may be just sell uh sell out all of the the NFT in just just for during during the pre-sale and we we won't open for the pre public sale. Yeah, and for the IDO for the token, uh, maybe around the um mm, the middle the middle of the February. Yeah. And uh, you're planning an, <clears throat> an Nymphers marketplace, or is it, I think that's already up on the website, is it? You've built the marketplace for the NFTs, yeah. Yeah. yeah so uh, so uh, the pre-sale will be done uh, through the marketplace. And and that's, uh, like I said, uh, the pre-sale whitelist will finish on uh, the 9th of uh, January, which is uh, Sunday. And uh, the pre-sale will start on the 14th. Uh, uh, you can actually go in or go into the, the marketplace and 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 purchase on the 14th of January. Um, and how does the tokenomics work for the Nympha uh, token? Pardon? The tokenomics, the buys and sells work for the uh, Nympha token. Tokenomics. Yeah. Yeah. Do you, uh, think you want to answer that? Talking about it. Uh, do, do you have the slide? Uh, which part do you want to ask? Uh, for the uh, angel run or for we will separate the different uh, different stage, different part. The first one is the angel run, and the second one is uh, uh, the the for private sale. Uh, yeah. So each step we will publish on our we will publish on our uh white paper, uh in our website. So uh, people maybe uh, can check the detail for the uh, our website, yeah, to see more further information, yeah. So and uh, maybe we yeah, can, uh, uh, yeah. So uh, we will publish the uh, our token for public sale. Maybe uh, for each one will be cost on uh, zero point three for one token. <laughs> and for, uh, yeah. NFTs are based on elvish type creatures. Uh, they look really cool. <clears throat> and I know it's, you know, you're building a big community in the English Telegram and the Chinese Telegram. Um, so, yeah, what's happening with the marketing going forward? You've got a big push into Asia as well as Europe and America and Canada. Yeah, um, uh, we actually started this project on uh, October, uh, September to October. And uh, we know we noticed that uh, X Infinity actually brought up a, a huge, you know, huge wave. So, so we think we start that that's where we start. We started with the um, the, the Southeast Asia uh, market, and then uh, gradually we we get into uh, uh, China and and Taiwanese market. Uh, we get heading back, and and now that and now we are going to into uh, uh, Europe and US market. So that's why we. Uh, Cooperating with uh, Wild Coin Talk, so so thank you for inviting us. <laughs> um, you're on the Ethereum blockchain. Are you looking to cross chain in the future to the BSC as well, or for for NFTs or for the token? We are, we're currently on uh, BSC, right? Uh, so uh, are, are we going to do cross cross chain thing? You, you, yeah, so it, maybe you, you're buying in the, the NFTs. <laughs> yeah. In Ethereum. Yeah. Uh, that you buy the NFTs in Ethereum, but you're on the BSC, is it? Sorry, yeah. Yeah. So I, I think we missed uh, the question. Um, it, Buying the NFTs, what's the cost to the investors, and is it in BNB or, or Ethereum? Okay, uh, it's it's in BNB, and um, each cost uh, now it's um, uh, is uh, point point one point one BNB, yeah, and the BNB is actually uh, pretty low this time. <laughs> Yeah, um, and are you looking to get audits done on the uh, contract uh, for the token before um, launch or after launch? Pardon, sorry. And to get uh, the contract audited before launch or after launch on the uh, okay. InfoWorld token. 
you have you have to turn on your mic thing. Yeah, uh, we have the center the audit. Uh, we 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 are we will. And we are now sending the auditing to the uh certificate company. Yeah, so we will keep uh uh we will we may get we may receive a report after around the in the end of the January or the February first, early February, early February. Yeah. And yeah, can we go a bit more into the uh the gaming aspect and uh, what investors uh, will be seeing there inside the game and uh, the staking. And the daily quest and maze adventures, it sounds really cool. Mm. Yeah. Sorry, was, was uh, that a question? Uh, yeah, I was just uh, asking if we can go into the info world, uh, the game that you're creating, the staking, the daily quest and the maze adventure. Can we go into okay. more detail about how that works for investors? Yeah, that's really cool. Okay, we we uh, the game is currently uh, in develop uh, in depth development right now. Uh, so uh, uh, just like I mentioned earlier, uh, the investors or the players can can uh, you need to uh, purchase like three uh, NFTs or nippers to start staking and um, idle idle game. I, idle game is like uh, you 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 leave uh, your uh, nippers there, and then uh, we will we will we are designing a like little little game. So so the nippers will like flow around, and and they uh, they will act they will automatically automatically to to uh, like like gaining uh, uh, different items and 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 points. So it will uh, raise up uh, uh, different levels and and gaining uh, different uh, tokens. Uh, so that's that idle game and. Um, you can actually uh, uh, you can actually breed them as well. So you, if you have like two different nippers, and then you can breed them together, and each nippers have like uh, uh, like uh, totally different faces, different parts. And uh, in this world, we have like four different elements like fire, wood, uh, water, and 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 earth. Uh, so it's it's a bit more like a strategy game that you have to come up. Because uh, each nipper have like different uh, sets of skills, so uh, you, you you need you need to like strategically to uh, align them align them to to, to battle, and so the, so that's uh, PVE and and that's uh, idle game and and staking as well staking uh, and as well. So so uh, and for the adventure, we uh, we are actually uh, building a uh, a storyboard. So. So it's it's not like it's not like uh you you turn on a game and then you play it's not 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 like that but but we we do plan out a a, a whole storyline so so the um, the players or investors can enjoy the whole story and we and we also we put in different uh, uh like different uh se seasonal different uh uh like chapters so like Christmas or, or Easter's or like different chapters in together so. We, we tend to make the, the game like a game and really fun, but it's not just like making money, but uh, you can play you can play it and enjoy it and while making a lot of uh, different rewards. And you built up a really big uh, dev uh, team there. Uh, Do you say over 30 devs uh, working on the game? And what's the size of the core team um, here at Nympha World and the mods and admins uh, working in the Telegram? Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, I think I think you should answer that question. It's like uh, how many how, how many people are working in development and how many people are doing uh, marketing? Yeah. Uh, for the um, I think for the game production is uh, about uh, twelve people, and for the marketing um for the marketing team, we got the support from the uh, marketing company. Um, that may be. Uh, around six to eight, six, and uh, for our own team, uh, to join the marketing event, that will be uh four people. So overall, um, uh, the overall team uh to uh focus on the Nipper World project, that will be uh around twenty to twenty three people. Yeah. 
great, a big team there. And uh, going forward, uh, before launch and after launch, what's the marketing plans uh, to get the Nympha token and the game out there to investors? Uh, what do you have planned uh, around the world uh, in, the, in the marketing area? Yeah. Um, we are actually uh, cooperating with the different uh, uh, brands, like because uh, we we have uh, like uh, experience uh, working with uh, like uh, big companies. So so uh, we are t we tend to uh, cooperate with different uh, like uh, YouTubers or uh, uh, like uh, VTubers as well. So so we we are trying to uh, connect with different uh, VTubers and YouTubers around the world and. So that's uh, one of the strategy, and 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 the other one is we are looking for uh, different uh, like uh, strategic partners. Uh, like we are currently uh, uh, connecting with uh, a European uh, investors. So uh, uh, in order to open the European uh, market, uh, so that that's one of it, and um, and uh, like we 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 tend to uh, cooperate with. Uh, like companies, they are not uh, like game companies. That that's one of our uh, uh, strategy. So so maybe like uh, like uh, like media company or uh, retails or uh, different companies to to actually uh, immerse uh, our different uh, image to different uh, different uh, different part of the the the, the business. So. Um, yeah, so so that's that's uh, like basically our uh, uh, our strategy. But uh, uh, if you if you guys want to know more about this uh, our plan, we can uh, actually uh, talk or you can uh, like uh, talk to us after this uh, AMA session. Yeah, yeah. This I uh, <clears throat> I have uh, some comment for this. Um, <clears throat> uh, we will use uh, because uh, we mainly focus on the. Uh, uh, AR VR production, so we will use the AR AR technology uh, or MR uh, MR MR technology to <clears throat> to asset accelerate our promotion. So uh, such as that, we may be use our uh, AR technology uh, to plus with the LBS local best service uh, uh, the content. So we can we can just image that uh, uh, application scenario that. <clears throat> Uh, people can uh, use our cell phone, uh, use their cell phone to scan the the Nipper's figure. Okay, so they can uh, pop up a uh, uh, animation, and uh, you can mint in the auto. And uh, um, this is what what we uh, expertise. Yeah. So maybe <clears throat> uh, we can uh, cooperate with a lot of the supermarket and the shopping mall and the strategy partners uh, and a famous YouTuber VTuber. Uh, in our countries and the over and the over 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 the world, yeah, to uh to be our strategic partners, yeah, to assert to get get our um, to get our better promotion, yeah. So that's all. Thank you. Okay, great. And are you planning with the AR where you can find it in the real world through your smartphone um, characters to play in the game and items you can find? Yeah, since we uh, got a, a lot of experience to um, holding the uh, exhibition center so uh, in Taiwan, so uh, we sell our uh, VR games and uh, we hope our uh, partners to uh, use AR technology to to promote their brand for brand marketing, brand marketing. So uh, we have a lot of experience to uh, <clears throat> use the, uh, uh, maybe you know, what, what is so-called online to offline, yeah, online merge offline uh, experience. So if online is our neighbor world, yeah, is the metaverse. So how, how to combine with the real uh, world in our country or oh, is the first step and how to uh, move on to other our other world, other countries is our next step. So uh, maybe uh, this is what we want to do in the uh, in the current stage. Yeah. So we search for uh, more a lot of we, we search for a lot of uh, strategic partners to join us uh, in the current stage. Yeah. <clears throat> 
and then you're incorporating VR into the uh, uh, Nympha world as well in the future, yeah. Yeah, yeah, we, we tend to do that. Yeah, like you said, maybe you can take your neighbors to, you know, go shopping or you know, take a photo with them and and while getting, while up, upgrading your neighbors. Yeah, so that's one of the strategies. Yeah. Cool. Uh, well, I can open it up to the rest of the team if we've got any questions for the Nympha World uh, team here. Oh uh, yeah, Higlin. I was I was looking at the the website and reading through the medium, and I saw like uh, it's a pretty fun uh, idle game, like you said, like for for the first one that you're putting out. So uh, you mentioned your your first collection was sold out. Can we still buy some on on the marketplace, or like uh, is it all just people holding and waiting for the game and staking? Um, we. Uh... Yeah, the first this, the first patch is actually uh, we we still have some left, but uh, like I said, we uh, we are having our pre sale on the ninth, which is uh, tomorrow. Um, yeah, yeah, tomorrow, uh, Sunday. Uh, so uh, you can always go into our website and click on the the Give Lab uh, event and then enter the whitelist. And um, yeah, so um, uh, then and then. Uh, we will sell it on the 14th. Yeah, and, and you mentioned like you need to own three for for the staking, but for the game, for the idle game, I imagine like you can have more where you build your team or like uh, looking forward to the evolution of it, right? It's not going to be like you have these three and there you go, you're done. Yeah, exactly. Uh, so you you will start with three. So you can you can buy one actually, but. But uh, it's better off if you, 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 if you uh, the idle game is start with three. So uh, if you own three, you can start the idle game. And then uh, for a PvP or PvE, you, you need to have like at least five. But you can have like 20 or 25 or 50, uh, whatever you want. And then uh, re restructure them or, uh, you know, so, so you have uh, like uh, different skills and for different battles. Yeah. And, and uh, yeah, it sounds cool. But uh, like, are there are there rewards for for the people playing? Is it going to be like a leaderboard where like the top players get some tokens, or is it going to be I don't know, like uh, each game that you win gets you some points, or uh, how does yeah. it work? Yeah, uh, for the idle game, we we have like three different uh, tokens in the game, uh, which uh, one uh, the, the the minimum amount of the token is called uh, the the uh, the crystal powder. So that's that's where you do the um, idle game and where your nippers can uh, you know you know uh, go into the uh, idle game and then win a uh, small amount of uh, nipper powders. So that allows you to uh, purchase different items or uh, potions in a game. And then the second one is uh, crystal uh, magic. Uh, so you can form a crystal magic uh, with uh, crystal powder uh, with certain amount of crystal uh, powder and. It can uh, enable uh, level level up your uh, nippers in PVE mode, and then uh, the ideal uh, token is called the nip token. Uh, you can gain it uh, with the the PV, PVP, uh, which is uh, the you know the battle with the real real people uh, with and in the tournament. So if you win a tournament, you will win uh, uh, the token. Yeah. So. So and uh, so with the staking mode, you need to put in your uh, nip nipper and your token, your ideal uh, the nip token in inside. So to generate uh, the rewards, yeah. Okay, yeah, that sounds like an interesting way to have it, like where you have to stake the tokens and stake the NFT, and then. For the game, it sounds pretty cool. Like when people get their initial dust, and then they can evolve that, and then use it for items, and actually participate in the PvP. And that's where the the, the real money earned will be, so to speak, right? Because you want like everybody would want to have like a super evolved one or whatever to put it on his team, and then be yeah. be the first one to take the prize. So yeah. it's so the 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 yeah the the P two E aspect is more centered on uh, on the PVP. So I like that. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah. Thank okay, you. Great. Uh, if we've got any more questions from the team, we've got a few hands up with investors. Um, Aisha, you had a question for the Nymphers World team. Are you there, Aisha? Hey everyone. Hi. Uh, okay, 
uh, my question to Ning for World Team is uh, that uh, on your roadmap, it's mentioned about breeding system, and you also mentioned about breeding system. What I want to know is that what are the requirements for breeding, and what factors will determine the value of new nymphs? Thank you. Okay. Uh, um, we uh, to to breed uh, nymphs, you need to have like two original nymphs. So so that means you need to buy it. Uh, from uh, the pre-sale, the, the, the first patch and the second patch that we are doing, uh, we are uh, wireless right now. So, so that's the first. Uh, so you need to have two of them, and then you breed them, and you will probably have like a small chance to 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 get rare nipper, like like special nippers. Uh, it has like different you know special parts on it. So, so that's that that's uh, how how we breed it, and and. To, to do the the breeding breeding system, you you also need uh, need tokens, which is the ideal token, to enable the the breeding. So so that that's the whole process. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I do have one more question. Can I ask? Yeah. Yeah. Sure. No problem. Yeah. Uh, uh, your uh, your game is uh, your game has player versus player mode, and uh, I want to ask that: Are you guys planning on launching multiplayer mode so that player can team up and battle against uh, each other? Okay, team. <laughs> are we going to uh, launch multiplayer? I I, I think we do. <laughs> uh, yeah. Multiplayer, no multiplayer mode. Multiplayer mode, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So everyone can team yeah. up. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, maybe uh, I will. I, I, I have to make sure that. So for at least like for PVE, there is not support for the multiplayer mode, but the PVP, that is definitely yes. <laughs> okay. Yeah. For PVP. Yeah. PVP. Yeah. Okay. Great. Thank you so much, and best of luck for your game. Yeah, thank, thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, yeah. We've got a question coming in from Ar Ariana. Hi, Ariana. You have a question for the Nympha World team? Hello, sir. Can I ask a question? Sure, please. Okay my, okay, my question is, do you have any maximum sell order each hour to avoid big dumping levels, giving time after each dump to recover while other buyers purchase more tokens? Thank you. Sorry, I didn't quite get your question. Can can you rephrase that or ask him? Sorry. Okay, my question is, do you have any maximum sell order each hour to avoid big dumping levels, giving time after each dump to recover while other buyers purchase more tokens? So, so, sorry, so the great thing, can you... Uh, I, I can, yeah, yeah, I can, I can she's it. sort of asking about the tokenomics right. when it launches. You can have like anti dump features and anti whale features, maximum wallets. Um, you know, if you've got uh, anti bot features built into the contract. Oh, okay, okay. Hello? Anti, anti bot features. Hello? Yeah. I, I think you need to answer that thing. Just muted her. Yeah, go ahead, guys. Yeah. Sorry, I can get it. So Eddie, so what's the problem? I can I can hear hear your laptop. So please pardon. Yeah. So so it's about tokenomics. So do we have any like 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 antibot or uh, how to protect? Is that, is was, that right? Is it, am I? Am would I, you please speak loudly? Can you hear me? Yeah. So uh, so sorry. Would you please speak loudly? You mean the uh, the the the, I, the lady? Hello. No, 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 uh, Eddie. Uh, yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah, so Eddie. Uh, so yeah. sorry, I can hear you. Yeah. Yeah. What's the problem? Yeah. I can get the the overall the the program. I I missed that message. So it's about tokenomics. So how? Yeah. Uh, if I'm if I hear it uh, right, it's about. How to protect the tokenomics and how to uh, prevent and uh, prevent bot to uh, anti bot, right? Am I right? <laughs> I'm yeah, sorry. Anti bot, I'm... anti whale features, um, you know, uh, protection in that from from dump. She was asking for. Yeah, yeah, worried about. Yeah. How to prevent for the bot? How to prevent for the bot, right? 
So we will um, we will set a limit limitation for the the mass uh, mass that uh, user can buy each for each wallet, and also uh, we will set uh, the 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 ceiling for the, the public sale, maybe just one percent, just for one percent. Yeah. So uh, this is quite limited because we want to uh, prevent for the bot uh, attention. Yeah, attacked. Uh, is, is that uh, all right? Ariana, all right? OK, thank you, sir. That's the plug for your project. OK, thank you very much. OK, uh, Sam Bukhari, you had a question for the InfoWorld team. Hello. 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 Yep. Yep. Can you hear me? OK, uh, my question is this. Do you have any maximum sale order each hall? <laughs> Hello? Hello, yeah. sir? Yeah. Yeah. Can you hear me? Yes, sir. Um, my question. In and out there, Sam. Hello. We can't hear you. I can't I can hear you, so sorry. And uh, go to uh, Asian Glamour. Asian, you had a question for the uh, Nympha World team? <clears throat> Hello, sir. Can you hear me? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Okay, sir. My question is I want to know that is it possible to breed the Nympha with any other player's Nympha? Thank you. Oh. Can, can our. Uh... Uh, the breeding system can only allow. Uh... Hey, actually, this is a good question. Can can our uh, Nifer bring breed with other Nifers, like other players' Nifers? Thing. Yeah, yeah, of course, sure. But uh, maybe uh, we can we can uh, we can allow to uh, breed for our our staff, but we can breed the our child with other people's. Yeah, Nifer. Our other our Nifers is okay. You know, you can bring with your mother or your sister. But you can support your, yeah, you can play with your friend. <laughs> you, you know what I mean? <laughs> okay, great. And then uh, we've got a question from Daisy. Daisy, you had a question for the Nympha World team. Yeah. Daisy? No? Okay. Yeah. Um, well, Anyway, uh, yeah, uh, we always say after you've had an AMA, uh, you're welcome to come back and keep us updated in our Whalecoin talk. Uh, anyone listening back to the recording, we share that around the crypto and the BSC space. Um, yeah, anyone that has any questions, we can get you safely over to the official Nympha World Telegram. Um, and uh, yeah, if we, maybe people have been joining while we've been uh, having the AMA, so maybe if we could just have a recap, guys, over the Nympha World project, the game, uh, yeah, so uh, anyone that joined in the middle of the AMA, they, they can get an idea of uh, what's happening with an InfoWorld project. Okay, so um, so uh, thank you for inviting us. And um, like I said, uh, we we are an InfoWorld. Uh, this is a uh, this is the game we we tend to make it uh, really easy to play, and and but with a little bit of strategy and uh, really fun to play, and it's actually an earn to play game. So. Uh, that's our goal, and we we are trying to uh, make the uh, the game long, not not like uh, like a short game, but we we tend to make it long, and this is why uh, we are telling uh, everyone that uh, we are a uh, actual company that based in uh, Taiwan Kaohsiung. So uh, you're more than welcome if you if, if if the pandemic is over, you're more than welcome to come to our country and 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 come to Taiwan Kaohsiung and look for us and um. So uh, Nipple World, and we are we are uh, currently looking for um, uh, like uh, corporate partners, strategic partners, and um, if you have any uh, marketing plans uh, that you you you, uh, you you suggest and you can help us, then uh, we are we're, we're more than welcome to to talk to you. And um, and last but not, but not least, we are our. Uh, pre-sale is uh, will will be ended on uh, Sunday tomorrow. That's uh, 9th of uh, 
uh, on the 10, uh, 10 o'clock UTC uh, time. So uh, take your chance to to go into the the, the page at uh, the, the GitHub page and then uh, put, uh, like finish the, all the quests and get into the white uh, the white list. And I'll be sales on the 14th of uh, January. So uh, thank you all for uh, listening. And we are uh, very grateful that uh, while uh, token, uh, uh, token talk can, uh, coin talk can uh, give us this time to uh, share with you guys. Yeah. Thank you very much. And if any investors want to get uh, an NFT, they can head over to the website now and uh, mint one, can they? Yeah. Uh, not yet. Not yet. We are. Uh, we are. Uh, and because uh, uh, we were still doing uh, the pre-sale, so uh, if you uh, if the investors want to mint uh, the the NFT, will be on the fourteenth of January, uh, and they need to have like whitelist. But uh, you know, we 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 try to give everyone uh, like a uh, really good have 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 a really good time. So uh, just talk to us and and see what can what, what we can do for you. If they head to your Telegram, there's white list spots to be won uh, in the Nympha world, NFT, yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Great. Uh, well, thanks very much for coming, guys. It's a really interesting uh, project. Uh, the world uh, looks cool, and the uh, uh, the little elf creatures uh, look really great. Um, yeah, and you've got a huge sort of uh, presence in Asia, so uh, this could be really good for European and American and Canadian investors. Uh, Thank you. everyone around the world uh yeah i'm looking forward to the future like i say uh keep us updated in the uh, text chat here at wellcoin talk for our investors that get involved with the project um, um any new features that are coming out and the gaming aspects uh that, yeah that'd be awesome uh thanks very much for coming yeah. today it's great talking thank you, to you uh yeah. take care okay thank you very much right thank you Hi, thank you all the friends thank you thank you Thank you, guys. Okay, thank you, thank guys. You. Bye. Okay. Thank you. Okay, bye, bye.